yeah, 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 Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? Hey, hey, she's back, she's back. Oh, you know, before I get into this video, guys, honestly, this shirt from Zara is really starting to piss me off. Um, or blouse shirt, whatever, you know what I mean. Like when I saw it on a mannequin, it sat so neatly and it didn't shift, it didn't move. But trust me, honestly, if you wear just a bra with this shirt, it will just open your breasts for everybody to see. It's so annoying. It just keeps on moving. Trust me, guys, you definitely have to wear a bust day. Luckily for me, I've got like this bust day thing underneath. You definitely have to wear like a bust day or some sort of vest top with this blouse because um it's just gonna expose you and it's just super duper annoying trust me but i do love it guys i will put the link down below it is beautiful i honestly it's just like it, it just dresses up everything i'm wearing it with jeans at the moment and um guys honestly speaking it just it just dresses up everything this makes everything look a lot more fabulous um but yeah guys before i get into this video you know what you guys do hit that subscribe button down below and make sure you follow me on Instagram and make sure you follow me on Snapchat too. Names are above as per usual. So guys, how was your Black Friday sale? Did you get any good bargains? To be honest with you guys, um, I don't know. I didn't really find much to be fair. Nothing I wanted. Most of the stuff I did want was full price. So I was just like, well, I guess it's just not really happening for, for me today. I don't know, I just feel like, and tell me if I'm wrong, I just feel like Black Friday is really good for gadgets, like televisions, um, computers, laptops, and so on and so forth. I don't really feel like it's that beneficial for like if you're trying to buy like clothing items or shoes and things like that. I don't know, I might be wrong, or maybe I'm just looking in the wrong places, but I really couldn't find anything personally um, during the Black Friday sale, and most of, most of the stuff was like 20% off. And I was like, well, it really should really be 50% because it's supposed to be like a, you know, Black Friday, do you know what I mean? I know it's an American thing, but still, if, we, if, we're, if we're trying to imitate something, then let's do it the way the Americans do it. Um, but I personally think for us, anyways, the best time for us to buy, you know, sell items and get the best bargains is Boxing Day, in my opinion. I feel like that's when, um, especially with clothing items, shoes and stuff, that's when we had the best sale here. But I didn't actually get anything drip in, in the sale. I actually purchased this full price because it's something I really, really wanted. Um, I've been wanting them for some time now. And the, the, the original ones I wanted were a bit expensive. And I was like, mm, am I really gonna spend that much money on a pair of sneakers? I was like, mm, I don't think I can do that. Cause they were like, I can't remember. I think they were like 1,100. And I was like, that's just a bit, that's a lot of money on a pair of sneakers, honestly speaking. Um, so I found another pair that I really, really, really liked. And I thought, yeah, these are really nice. I can rock these. Um, I can rock these easily um, during, you know, winter and summer. So I think it kind of, kind of cross over through all the seasons. Um, so yeah, I was really happy with this purchase. And yeah, hey guys, can't wait to show you. These trainers, I must say, or these sneakers, I must say, are, um, they're really unique. You, you have to have an eclectic taste <laughs> for you to get it. Because I know some people can look at them and be like, Ugh, they're, they're hideous. And I'm really into the sneakers these days. Like me and my husband, we are all about just buying re really, really sick, exclusive sneakers. I, and not even just like designer ones. I'm even just talking about in general, like Adidas's, Nikes, whatever. We really just want to buy and have a range of amazing, amazing sneakers. I don't remember last time I've actually purchased a pair of heels because these days I've just been buying sneakers, buying sneakers, buying sneakers. But enough of all that waffle, waffle, guys. Let me show you what I got. So I got the Versace Two Chains Collaboration Trainers. Yes. You know what? I've been seeing these trainers for some time now, for months. And listen. I don't know if I'm slow or something. I did not actually know they were Versace for a time, let alone know that they were Versace 2 Chains collaboration. I've been slow in this game, boy, because I saw them on, I saw them on David Doe. I was like, oh my God, those trainers are sick. Then I saw them on um, one of the one of the, one of the cast members from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I can't forget her name, the girl that sells the weave or does the eyebrows. I can't remember her name, but she's, she's really pretty. Um, I saw them on her and I was like, these trainers are sick. Like, what are these trainers? What are these trainers? And I didn't know they were Versace for time, guys, for time. It wasn't until like maybe like three months ago that I clocked out. Oh my god, these Versace trainers, Versace trainers. So yeah, I've been hunting them down for a minute and um, it's been hard for me to get them in my size. 
Um, really, really difficult for me to get them in my size, but eventually I found them in Harrods. Yeah, shout out to Harrods. I found them in Harrods, and yes, I've got them, guys. So let me get to showing you these fabulous, fabulous trainers. I do apologize for, in advance for my shirt shifting, shifting, because I don't even know what it's doing right now. It's, gonna, it's super duper annoying. But anyways, this is the box, and it's got the chains on it, as you can see, and the Versace head. Obviously, the chains are obviously for two chains, and the Versace head is Versace. Absolutely love it. Uh, and you know right now, if I actually get into showing you them even more, you know right now it's the season for the bulky trainers. I'm so, I right now, I just need a pair of Balenciagas to add to my collection of bulky trainers. Cause I'm, I'm getting a bit by bit, but I'm, I'm so into bulky trainers. I, I, I'm just loving them. But anyways, guys, all right. So like this, then you've got the, um, you've got the, what you call it? What do you call this again? The trainer bag or the protector bag that you keep them in, which is like that, which is super duper 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 cool. And yes, these are the best. Ah! <laughs> hold on, well they're quite chunky for me to hold at both at the same time. Okay. Oh, hey. <laughs> okay, so these are them, guys. I absolutely love them. Now, if you're a sneakerhead, you will totally, 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 totally get this. Let me put one down so you guys can see this properly. You will totally, totally, totally get this. Oh my god, I was like so happy. <gasps> oh my god, guys, I was so so happy because I like I like the colour as well. Um, the white mixed with the neutral grey kind of black as well. The original ones I wanted had like some sort of like leopard. Um, suede, like, look, it was multicolored and it was super duper cool, but the price wasn't cool, so I was like, ah, nah, <laughs> nah, I'm not getting those because these are already quite expensive. These retail at um, £770, so they're quite dear already. So I was like, listen, that's it's a stretch getting these. I definitely don't think I'm getting the other ones, but I'm super duper happy, guys. Um, they are so, 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 so pretty. Uh, like, they just, oh, come on. I know they're not for everyone, but they're so freaking nice. And look, you've got, even got the chain detail at the back for two chains, which is super duper dope. I love that. I love how they mixed, like, his name and his kind of, like, his brand with the Versace. Because obviously you've got the Versace head on it. Then you've got the Versace signature pattern. You know the signature pattern here that they put on this, their, their shirts and stuff like that and on their bags. Um, you've got that there as well. But let me give you guys a bit, a bit of a close-up so you have a, a better see all the details. Honestly, absolutely love, 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 love. There you go. You get to see, you know, the Versace pattern just here. You know that you know the the famous Versace pattern. Then at the this is the inner sole. I still got the tissue paper inside. Just normal inner sole, quite basic. Then you've got the Versace logo at the back here. Absolutely love. Absolutely love, guys. Then, obviously, you've got Versace written on the side there. Absolutely love these trainers. Then, if I turn it over, again, I'll show you. You've got the Versace, famous Versace logo there. And you've got the chain. Chain reaction. Absolutely love these trainers, guys. I definitely feel like they're a great purchase. Especially if you're a sneakerhead and you're into sneakers. I definitely feel like these are ones that most sneakerheads should definitely get have in your collection. They're super duper fierce. Absolutely love them and I'm so happy with this purchase, guys. I'm gonna try them on for you also. I also love um, the detail on the laces, guys. I don't know if you can see that, but I absolutely love that. I think that's super duper cool the way they've dipped it in like the plastic or whatever it is. I love that, so it doesn't fray. So I do, I do love them, guys. Um, with regards to sizing, I um, got a size. I got a size 37. I did try enough because I normally actually go down a half size with designer trainers. So I usually actually get a size 36 and a half. 
but I don't know, I felt they were a little bit pinchy. And I didn't want to make the same mistake I made with my Chanel trainers that um, I ended up selling. Um, I got them in a size 36 or 36 and a half. And they were so, they were extremely uncomfortable. Like, they were hurting my feet. Like, they were so painful. And I was like, wow, I spent all this money on these trainers that I can't actually even wear. So I didn't want to make that mistake again. I just, I know with Gucci, I definitely go down a whole size because their, their brand just comes up huge. But with this one, I tried on both and um, I was like, mm, the 36 was nice and it fit, but it was just a little too snug for the way I like. And these ones are just a tiny bit, a little bit too big, but I would just wear like trainer socks with them. So I, was, I got the 37. So I would definitely say um, stick to your size, but if you're unsure, if you can, try and go try try go to a store and um and try them on. But I would say stick to stick to your size, get your actual size. Um but yeah guys, I was I'm super duper happy with this purchase. Um I got some more unboxings and some more reviews to be doing, so you will be seeing some more videos of those um coming up as well, guys. So yeah, this is just a quick, nice and easy unboxing. Um I hope you like it and guys, I will put the link down below for these fabulous trainers especially if you're sneakerhead like me and um yeah you are trying to like up your sneaker game because that's one thing i'm definitely trying to do right now is up my sneaker game then i definitely would encourage you to get these trainers they are a bit bulky but they're not heavy unlike um the balenciaga so i've tried them on they're really really heavy and even like my louis vuitton ones here um they not that they're heavy but they are they are quite bulky as well but these ones are really light they're really really super duper light you don't even feel like you're wearing something so thick um to be honest with you and it looks so cute on the feet um and you can just rock it with everything track suits jeans dresses whatever they're so versatile so i do love them guys so yeah um they're available on so many other sites you can get them from harrods you can get them from uh farfetch i can't remember if they're on netaporta they might be on netaporta i can't remember but um yeah and also harrods and selfridges so yeah guys but sizes are going quickly like they what i think once they release them like sizes go like wildfire but yeah Thanks for watching guys and remember to subscribe to my channel, remember to follow me on Instagram and follow me on Snapchat names are above and yeah, till next time, bye!